Yo mama is so short that she could do backflips under the bed. <laughs> Yo, what's going on? I'm Ian Dior, and this is my first for Enemy. Uh, the first show that I went to, wow. That, it was Lil Baby and Trippy Red in Corpus Christi. That is a crazy show that I, that I, it was my first experience seeing like what it's like to be on stage. And also shout out Trippy, we just fucking dropped a song. So y'all, y'all go run his shit up. <laughs> um, the first, Artist that I fell in love with was definitely Kanye because he dropped My Twisted Dark Fantasy and that was a big part of my life. The first CD I ever bought was 2014 Forest Hills Drive by J. Cole. I, I remember vividly going to Best Buy and copping that shit before CDs went away. The first song that I finished writing, well, the first song that I ever dropped I dropped it after I kicked out of my house. It was called Where You At? And everybody was asking me where I was at because I kind of just disappeared. Um, and I didn't really speak to anybody, so I, I just put out the song. And I think that's like the first time that I've ever seen like a few thousand plays. I think I got like 14,000 uh, streams on SoundCloud and that got me started. First job I ever had was at Little Caesars. I was in that bitch making pizzas. I thought it would be lit because I love pizza, but it really just made me hate fucking pizza, honestly. And I quit, I think after like two weeks. <laughs> the first tattoo I ever got was this one right here. Um, it was whenever I told myself I was gonna dedicate myself to music and I didn't tell nobody about it. I kind of just came home with it. <laughs> and yeah, my parents were pretty pissed, but they got over it. <laughs> The first text I sent this morning was to my my day-to-day -day manager and I told her, yo mama is so short that she could do backflips under the bed. <laughs> yeah, that's that. <laughs> first time I ever heard my song on the radio, my dad called me. I wasn't even in the car. My dad called me and he was just fucking hyped up. He and it was uh it was Gone Girl. Gone Girl was playing on the radio and he was just like he was tripping out because being a kid from Corpus and being born in Puerto Rico is not really normal for you to be playing on the radio, so my dad was super happy. The first picture I posted on Instagram, um, well, because I, I changed my name to Ian Dior on the way to LA, so I would consider that being the first picture that I posted was me leaving Corpus, and I remember the caption was, on to the next chapter. Uh, first thing I do whenever I get off stage after a show, I go back to the tour bus. I take a breather because I'm usually fucking, I'm winded. My shows are like a workout. Everybody leaves drenched in sweat. Um, but I really just kick it. I put on a fucking movie that I fuck with and I head over to the next city. First thing I'm gonna do when my album is released, I'm gonna throw a fucking album release party and all y'all are invited. Y'all pull up, we are gonna have a good time. Well, I'm Ian Dior, and that is my first for Enemy. Make sure you stream Still Here. It's a two-song EP that I just dropped, and I got a song in there with Trippy Red called Shots in the Dark. Okay. Yeah.